what have we done so far in a biostimulant pack? We've done the Humic 12, Air 8, and the RGS. The next step is the Microgreen 002. And in this, you know, obviously, uh, when we're taking care of the yard and we're talking fertilizers, we think, and you've ever done a soil test, you'll see you've, you've got macronutrients, which is your uh, NPK, and micronutrients. And that's all on your soil test. And a lot of times you'll find that you need to do something about the micronutrients in addition to your normal fertilizer program. What you can do with that is the Microgreen 002. This contains most all of the uh, micronutrients, uh, including manganese, sulfur, copper, iron, magnesium, and zinc. So w with this, it, it gets all those micronutrients back in there. Um, great stuff to use. You can use this on the grass. You can use this on uh, trees and shrubs and all that. The instructions are all on the bottle. Or I'll put a link below to uh, um, the next website that will give you a little more detail. But what I'm going to do today is I'm going to put it out on the lawn. And there's a couple ways you can do this. Um, you can put it out and leave it as a foliage application. And it really helps darken the grass. And I've got some weather coming anyways, kind of doing this quickly. Um, that's kind of the ideal way to do it. Or you can just water it in. It doesn't really matter. But for the grass, what I'm doing this year is uh, three ounces per thousand square feet on the grass. And I'm also going to, while I'm out here, I'm going to hit these uh, evergreens behind me with it and try and spruce those up a bit. They've got a little bit of damage from the cold over the winter. Um, and see if it helps at all. I've never really tried it on the evergreens. But uh, let's get to putting this out today. So I hope you guys can hear me over my neighbor trying to catch up to me here. Um, I also put some microgreen out here and if you haven't seen some of this yet, I'll try and get a, a good picture of this. Uh, this is an area I had a vegetable garden and we just haven't been using it. So we tore that out and I'm going to plant some uh, grass here in the fall. Um, when I renovate this entire backyard. Uh, it, there's a lot of poa back here, a lot of poa trivialis. Uh, poa annua is just out of control. So, I'm and it needs to get leveled. So, I'm just going to re renovate it. It's not very big. I'm also going to get rid of this travel trailer, move it up to here where it belongs, and uh, replant the grass back over there that was there three years ago. And I've had some other toys I had up here, and they're gone. So, um, lots more to come. Uh, it should be interesting to. Uh, the front area, if you watched a lot, my last couple of videos, reseeding, it's going along great. Uh, I'll do an update on that later. Um, any questions, 
ask down below. I'll gladly answer them. Um, if I don't answer them, there's a Facebook group that has been extremely helpful for quite a few guys. It's called Grass Goons. Um, I'll put a link down below. Uh, go check them out. Join the group. There's a lot of people in there, a lot of really knowledgeable people that will help out. Um, great group, great group of people. Um, check that out, and uh, we'll see you in the next video.